Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. So I actually wanted to do a quick review for you guys on the new Fiona Styles foundations. I got the matte finish and the luminous finish and I wanted to show you guys how they looked on. So I'm going to do one side of my face in the luminous and one um, in the matte. And also I wanted to share with you guys a quick tip on how to make all luminous, well I should say most luminous foundations more matte and for me it makes them super matte all right let's get started okay so on this side of my face I am going to be doing the luminous foundation because I have prepped my face like I normally do and on this side I'm gonna do the matte foundation and I actually have not prepped this with anything um, I just we just my moisturizer and that type of thing but no primer no nothing um, because I really want to see the actual matteness if you can say um, of the foundation but I did want to share with you guys a quick tip. If you guys have the Mirad Invisibler Perfecting Shield, this is a two-in-one or three-in-one product. It has SPF 30 in it. It has a bunch of skin-loving and anti-aging ingredients in it, and then it's also a fabulous primer. Now, if you are kind of more normal or combination or oily, try this as your one step. So instead of primer, instead of, you know, all of your other things you put on your face, try this first and see the amazing results you get from it. Your foundation will look smooth, flawless, and super, super matte. All right, so uh, let's get started. I am in shade three. Now I did wear this once and it is a little light for me so I probably would go with shade four, but hey, let's just do it. All right, so the foundation, it comes in this kind of cute little pump here, it's perfect. And this goes on really kind of full coverage. I'm actually super impressed when I wore this all day, it really stayed quite um, in place. It went on super, super easily. This is a cruelty-free line, so yay for that. But also, this luminous foundation is not super dewy. So it is definitely appropriate for everybody that has dry, of course, um, normal and then you can totally wear this if you have combination oily skin. I don't think that it's super luminous. Actually you could try the trick of getting this primer and it would be super matte. Comment below and let me know if you guys want me to see or want me to show you guys that trick actually being done. Alright, so I just put a pump and a half on my hand because it's obviously just for one part of my face and the coverage is really fantastic. It goes on very, very quickly. So let's just get this all on and see what the finish looks like. Alright, so you can actually see it has a natural luster to it but it's not overly dewy. So I totally get why she called this a luminous foundation, but I don't want you guys to be frightened by that name. It is not super dewy, but it is definitely a full coverage foundation. It did an amazing job on covering my pigmentation. Uh, amazing. Um, and went on super, super easy. All right, so let's try the matte. I actually have not tried the matte yet, so this we will be doing together. Okay, so obviously the matte foundation is a little bit thicker, which is totally normal due to the formula not having a slip to it, but let's see the coverage of this one. All right, totally similar in coverage. I love to see that. So you really are getting consistency in this foundation line because the coverage does not waver no matter if it's the luminous or the matte. And I actually prefer to wear matte on my nose. I don't know if any of you guys else are out there like me, but my nose for some reason hates foundation. Even if I have a primer on, it just hates it. So I find that a mattifying uh, foundation really goes on a lot 
better over that area. That is beautiful. Okay, I am definitely hooked on this foundation. I could totally wear the matte as well. All right, it did a beautiful job on covering up my hyperpigmentation, which you know is like my pet peeve. And you can see the difference, you can see the difference between the two sides of my face. So you can see that this has like a natural glow to it, and this one is pretty flat, but it's still not super, super matte. Um, you know, unlifelike. This is, this is gorgeous. Wow. My oily girls out there, try this and comment below and let me know if you guys have found that this foundation works for you. Wow. That is like, I didn't even use all of the foundation I had. Wow. Okay. Huge, huge fan. Let me go and set it and do the rest of my makeup and we'll come back and recap. All right, you guys, so uh, my, my makeup is all on. I obviously have put all of my um, blush and everything on. So my final thoughts on these are, yes, I love these. You know, I try on so many foundations. You know I'm so obsessed with foundations. But these foundations really live up to their hype. Um, way to go Fiona Styles. Nice formulation. Really, really, really great products. Uh, so if you guys have tried these, let me know what you guys think. And if you guys are new, thank you guys so much and welcome to the family. And don't forget you guys are so loved. I love you guys so much. Thank you again. And I will talk to you guys soon. See you on the next one. Bye. Mwah.